So you might ask yourself, how did an average Christian like me end up making a, a movie about a Catholic priest? Well, the reality is we didn't set out to make a movie at all about Father Flanagan. We were making a movie about troubled youth and, and alternatives to prison. And what we came out with is a whole new way of looking at the world. I say new, but really it was invented, created, and realized by Father Flanagan with what he did at Boys Town. And this actually started all the way back in 1917. Now what, what he started with was just an idea, an idea that there are no bad boys. And that might seem pretty simple to say there are no bad boys, but it has profound implications because if what's wrong with the world is not the inherent evil, you know, at the soul of bad people, at the soul of these youth. If what's wrong with the world is not them, but they're lacking skills, they're lacking opportunities, they're lacking examples, then suddenly what's wrong with the world is fixable. It's approachable. It's something we can handle and do something about. And that's what's so inspiring about Father Flanagan. He came up with the fundamental idea that we can change the trajectory of a child's life because they are and want to be good.